Hello again. Um, this time, due to a lot of people asking for it, I'm going to show you exactly how you update the English navigation. Starting off at the AMS website, you can find the location or the website address on the box, on the back of the manuals, um, on the back of the unit, underneath the AMS logo, it also has the AutoSound website. It will also be in the description. Um, what you do is you go to the AMS website and hit this button. When you hit this button, this window will appear. Enter in the um, serial number, which is located on the back of your unit, right here. into these spaces. After you enter this, you click the confirm button. What that will do is take you to this data, this page. Now you can take full data, which is the actual um, Rousen program and all data pertaining to it, or you can just update the safety information. Now if you click the full data download, a little download screen will come up and you'll download the file. Once you download the file, the file will look like this. This bottom one here. And what you do is you open that file and it's a zip file so you'll need a, a zip program. Um, WinZip, WinRAW, whichever one you, you use to unzip it. So you can take this program, click on it, Go, you will open up the zip program and unzip it and exact, extract it. You can either extract it to the same location or the desktop, wherever you may find it. But once you get to this, you can open up the file as such. Now there's two options. You can go to setup, which will allow you to just insert the... Um, SD card, either using the uh, SD card adapter or if your computer reads SD cards, insert it into the SD card slot. And what it'll do is, is you'll open up the program, hit setup, and hit start. And what this will do will wipe the SD card clean, including your save file. Or you can actually just come here to this file, which is. The plus N, the symbol is here. Open this up, and there's a Navi file. Now the way you use this Navi file is, is you'll actually take the SD card, put it in your slot, and open that file. Um, just like so. As you can see, I have several different files on mine because I have 16, a 16 gig SD card. But you see the Navi file here. What you do is you take the save file, drag it to your desktop, and hit back button, which brings you back here. You can take the Navi file, delete it, come back to here. Take this navigation, this Navi file, and drop it into this onto the SD card. Now, once you've done drop that, once you've dropped that onto the SD card, you can take the save file and drop it into the new Navi file that you have on the SD card. So that way, now you have all your old saves and all your old um, destinations on the new file. Not to mention that if you have movies or music saved on the SD card you won't lose any of those as well. Now once you've done this you'll have the Navi file and um, maybe a few other folders on there but at this point the Navi file is updated. Um, you can also just take it out of the machine 
onto the computer. Like so. And set it back into the navigation. Right here. So you can set it back into the navigation. And when you took plug it back in and turn it on, you'll have the new updated file. Um, if you have any questions about this, feel free to leave a, a comment at the bottom and I will address the questions as they come to me. Um, yeah, if you need anything else, just let me know by the messages at the bottom of the screen. Thanks.